think we're about ready. Alright. So, we gotta focus on getting the standard chips so we can fight base, so then we can enter Black Earth. Uh, I think we're all good to go. Let me swap it over. I'm just gonna have to keep an eye on the stream. Let me double check. We didn't crash, did we? We have not crashed. That's a good sign, right? Well, I won't say that's a good sign. It is definitely a sign. Okay. Hey, how you doing? Let's hang out for a bit. So we are first gonna we are gonna take care of a few things first. The main goal right now is to focus on the standard chips. I have a bunch. Did we crash? Did we crash again? Or is it buffering? I think it was buffering. Hold on. Okay. I think we're still good. It doesn't look like we crashed. I always have to double check these things because you never know. Okay. So, I have a bunch of tabs open. <laughs> I want to get through these. We're going to start with the lotto numbers. All right, let's go. And as you saw, I found like four throughout the game. I missed a lot of them, and a lot of them are not even in this game. Like normal. Okay. You're going to have to suffer through this music with me. Alright. First lotto number. This was at the Coliseum on a stone pillar. I did not see this one. Let's see. Hold on. Okay. Six, eight, zero, zero, nine, zero, nine. Two. You get White Shot 3T. Okay. This one's at the dome. Oh, this is the one, one of the ones I found. This was the garbage. At Den Dome. Four, six, two, nine, two, nine, eight, three. Flame line one G five five seven six zero four three three five. This is at the Yumland gas can. I don't think I saw this one. Flame line 3J. This one's at the Sharo house. I think I saw this one. 8801979791. Twin Fane 3G. Okay. 0 Three, six, nine, six, four, one, six. Oh, did I did I mess up that one? Okay, hold on. I must have. Uh, zero, three, six, nine, six. Four. Oh, I see. Four. Five. Eight. Here we go. Zero, three, six, nine, six, four, five, eight. This one, I don't know. We don't know where it's at. Varsword C. I must have got it confused with the... Seven seven zero three eight four one six Air Hockey three V Okay. 
three, two, one, zero. Eight, two, five, one. Snake R. We're just going through all of these. Uh, we don't know. Air Hockey 3 was apparently in the observation room on, on a computer. I don't think I saw that one. Snake R, we don't know where that one is. So, this one. There was a heel navi in Undernet 4 under a bridge. I don't know if I saw this one. Six, six, seven, zero, three, four, two, two. Recover three hundred J. We needed that one. Apparently, we don't know where this one's at. One, nine, zero, nine, five, six. Seven seven. PowerPoint star. I feel like I've had that a few times. Okay, this one was in the Vampire Manor. I think we've found this one. Seven four two nine three zero nine nine. Gun Soul EX. That one is really good. It's basically Gun Soul, but it hits two tires, two tiles instead of instead of one or two, not two tiles, uh, two columns. I might throw that one in. This one's the Z Saber, which I got one from the from the download ships. I wonder if this still counts. Let's check. Seven two seven nine four one three seven. Let's see if this let's see if this one works. Apparently it was never revealed. Okay, it does work. Two Z sabers. All right, those are all the chips. Okay. One, six, five, eight, nine, six, five, zero. Mini energy. You want to chat? Oh, wait, what happened? Buffering? Okay, probably just buffering. Okay, let me go back. Apparently that one, that code was in front of Castello. The sign, I think I found that one. Four, five, seven, nine, eight, three, three, one. This one, apparently, you get this code in Battleship Challenge. Mini energy. Apparently we don't know where this one is, or at least the site doesn't, anyway. Eight, nine, one, one, three, seven. A full energy. Eight, four, six, two, five, seven, nine, nine. Full energy. Two, four, two, four, seven, three, zero, nine. Sneak run. Eight, nine, eight, six, six. Three, zero, two. Another sneak run. 
Uh, can I even use these next ones? Yes. Yes, I can. Zero, two, three, six, eight, nine, nine, five. On trap. One, four, seven, six, nine, seven, four, five. Another on trap. I guess that was all. Oh, that one was the one that was in Vampire Manor, the one I found. There was another one in there that we didn't find. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure I could do this one. Two, two, seven, nine, seven, nine, six, zero, nine. Two, seven, nine, seven, nine, six, zero, nine. Apparently, this one is in Battle Chip Challenge as well. Lock enemy. Three, seven, nine, seven, nine, Eight nine four zero. Another lock enemy. Wait, can I do these next two? Yes, I can do these next two. Zero zero two seven four three zero four. One unlocker. One. Four. Eight. Seven. Two. Three. Two. Two. Unlocker. All right. Those are all the sub memories. Seven. Five. Four. Two, zero, one, zero, seven. Custom two program. Don't know where you're supposed to find some of these. Okay. Uh, zero, two, one, zero, nine, five, four, four. Mega Folder 2. Apparently, that one's also from Battle Chip Challenge. 0, 2, 1, 7, 8, 9, 2, 4. Buster Pack. Or Bust Pack. Whatever. Uh, don't know where you're supposed to find that one. Again, some of these are probably through manga, anime, stuff like that. You know, real life promotions that we that's lost to time. Four three four nine four three seven two body pack. Seven, three, two, nine, eight, one, zero, zero. We got Rush. Rush is a multiplayer one, or one that really works on multiplayer. Two, five, four, three, five. Four, two, eight. We got beat. Another multiplayer one. One, zero, one, seven, zero, five, zero, six. We got tango. We're almost done. Three, zero, eight, seven. Three, um, six, four, two. This one's also from Battle Chip Challenge. HP plus 500. Nine, 
seven, six, one, eight, seven, three, nine. That five, uh, HP plus 500, don't know where that's from, but that is the last of the lotto numbers. I am currently wanting to get away from this music. I'm trying to escape the music. Let me delete that tab. Let me double check. Where are we at? Okay. So let's see. Uh, wow, that takes up a lot of space. Might be worth it more. We'll see. Uh, mega folder. Sneak run. Oh, block. So I found out where battery is. It's in the antenna in Sharo, which we can only get there through the cold man scenario, so I actually can't get it right now. Hopefully we don't need it. Buster pack. Attack speed and charge is plus three each. So it'll bring all of it to plus four. It's not bad. But you would if you want to max them all out, you still need to add another set. Body pack. Four items to protect. Wait, what does that mean? <laughs> On, I have a list here. Okay, body pack. It gives you super armor, undershirt, float shoes, and air shoes. Okay. Let's stop. Versus only, you find an opponent. I guess if they use invis or something, it like stops that. Take high level chips, I think. Uh, beat if they use like a navi chip like a, uh, a mega chip I think it will seal it tango heals in a pinch anyway let's see anything else HP plus 500s okay alright I won't need this tab up for right now but I'll keep it these are chips. These are data. Oh, okay. So, two of the chips that we need. Uh, one's Moco Rush 2, and we also need one from one of the... It's like the wood breath thing. So, we have to... F we're gonna... Ha they're not gonna be on the net. And remember, I was looking for the sheep. Apparently... When you're in level three up, you know, your third run through up, and you need to find this virus, the ticket booth is apparently the only place you could find this enemy. And it's only a single one. There is a list of uh, viruses that you can find. Uh, of the counter, the counter tables, I should say. And apparently... I checked through, like, all of them. And this is the only one that has a level 2 sheep. That I've looked. It, and this site gives images of all of them. It's a 5% chance to find... We have lock enemies. So, if we don't get the chip... We have lock enemy. I checked through Goddess Comp. I've checked through Hero's Statue. And when it comes to this sheep, this is the only place it's at. And it's like a 5% encounter rate for this enemy formation. And uh, if you try to use something like Oil Body or Battery, no luck. Just a normal encounter. Ain't that fun. Nope, not this one. Keep it going. So we're just gonna keep running around until we find this enemy. Not yet. 
Still not here. Once we find this enemy, we need to go into another one of these to find one more, and then I think we're done with collect. For now, anyway. Unless I need to get, like, another chip. For program advances. But for now. Nope. Not here. Again, it's like 5%. Where are you? There's no point in using Sneak Run. I would just lose... All of my chances. Just keep on running into encounter after encounter. Come on. Where are ya? Nope. I mean, the site tell is telling me this enemy is here and not the ice cream stand. I looked. I could check again. But I, I'm looking at only, only the ticket comp is where the sheep is. Somewhere. I swear, un unless the internet's lying to me again, which this is my only shot, so I really hope the internet's not lying to me. Keep this going. So, like, this formation right here is, like, an 11% chance of finding it. Most of them are 11% chances. Actually, every other fight is an 11% chance, whereas the one I need to find is a 5%. So, yeah. Again, nothing like oil body would actually help. It will actually make it a zero percent. And I know we're going to have to make money rounds to buy whatever chips I'm missing. Mostly at the net dealer in Natopia. I'm thinking what we'll do to do, like, money runs is we'll start in probably Sharo. And what we'll do is we'll start in Sharo, we'll set up an untrap. It could be... Uh, it doesn't have to be Sharo, but... Hell, I could start at Dex's PC. And then go th trip through Yumland if I wanted to. But, like, the idea is to start at Sh Sharo or head to Yumland, either or. And... Grab all the green mystery datas along the way, of course, with Untrap set up. And just get every green mystery data along the way. Make a trip through Netopia. Grab all the green mystery data, go through Netfrica, and then start going through Undernet. And then probably go, well, at this point, go through, un 
get to Undernet 5 because there's more green there. Just make a money trip. You know, that's probably the way to go. And we still got to do another playthrough. Uh, that's the sad part about this. I kind of wanted to save base for like the fourth playthrough so when I take care of everything else. But if I want that blue mystery data, I basically have to do it now. All right, I just remembered. Do I want to throw Gun Soul in here? Let me look. I only have three Mega Chips. I can put in two more. And look, uh, it would match with Prick's power as well as my other Gun Souls. Uh, I could get rid of the Magnet Bolt or a Bubble Side or a Vulcan. Now nah, we could get rid of a Bubble Side. Gun Soul EX. See, I have like six color points. Not yet. There we go. Gun Soul EX. Let's keep on going. 5% encounter rates are so great, right? This is fun, right? Not you. Hmm. Nothing. Oh, come on. We have this. We have... Uh, there's one in, I think, a Yumland side, uh, like, statue to find. We should also grab Boy Bomb 3. Oh, yeah, I wanted to go into Meteor Comp. Grab the blue mystery data there, kind of go through the dungeon, find Boy Bomb 3. Because might as well, right? Still not here. Ticket comp. Yeah, this is what I'm reading right. This is the only sheep in here, supposedly. I feel like I'm going insane. Unless the internet's lying to me. Here, let me see if I can find... Uh, it would be, like, the stand comp. Because there's no ice cream stand comp, it would just be a stand. Yeah, it's not... I see the level 1 sheep, and that's what we're finding, but I don't see the level 2 sheep in, in there. Assuming this list is correct. I'm really starting to wonder if it's actually here. I'm wondering if the internet's lying to me. Or if this 5% is just really not wanting to proc. I 
I, I, I'm starting to think the internet's lying to me. And this is why you get, you take a run through at every playthrough and get every chip you can. Especially the level twos, honestly. Honestly, I think the level twos are more important to get. Like, as soon as you can. Because it feels like I'm not finding, like, level twos. You'll find level ones everywhere. In these small areas. Small computers. But the level twos? Nah. Never gonna pop up. There really should have been an... Uh, obviously, they didn't think this through, but... There really should have been a Navi Customizer program where it upgrades a virus to the next level. And how would... You only get it on your third playthrough. That way you can't get level threes on your second playthrough. Although trading's a thing. Maybe you make it to where you can't trade it. And so what you do is... You make the, these computer comps... Obviously, you're going to find level 1s all the time, but you put in this Navi Customizer program, it upgrades the viruses to the next level, so now you're finding level 2 stuff everywhere. That's a concept. But if it's a level 3, that's it. You, you don't get a level 3. Lying to me. I'm starting to, uh, like, we never got that 5%. And I doubt Sneak Run is supposed to help me because I'm too overpowered. Because they are, there's an EX in there. No, no, there is an EX in there. I mean, I could try Sneak Run, but I'm, here it is, finally. Here it is. Okay. My best shot is this. Come on. Okay. Lock enemy. Make a save. There we go. We finally found it. The internet didn't lie to me. It's just that 5% sucks. Here we go. Um, this is not that great of a starting. Don't worry, I already saved. Help us all. Uh, it's going okay, Juice. Right, right now we are. Trying to fight base because I have to and I'm stuck trying to get a level 2 chip And this is the only spot I can find this guy So that's fun Hope everything's going well Double delete come on Now the game's mocking me I missed the chip grind. <laughs> yeah, it is what it is. Yeah. Kind of. Uh, okay. With the power of Frick's power, I won't get a double delete. I should have waited, but it's all okay. How's your uh, Brilliant Diamond playthrough going? Very nice. There it is, Moko Rush 2, finally done with that. I can now get rid of this tab. <laughs> Alright, I need to go to a statue comp, which I believe this is in Yumland, I think. 
because there's got a statue here, a statue. And then this is just a statue comp, and I think that's this one. Yep. Okay. So I could throw in jungle. Uh, it would reduce some of the encounters, but not all of them. It would increase it from a 5% to a 7%. So, it's not that great of a boost. Having fun with it? I'm glad you are, because honestly, when I played through it, I was just... <sighs> was bored the right word? It was very underwhelming. I remember, although, when I was trying to do post-game, because my friend bought me it, and he's like, if you can help me get the exclusive sort of thing, and there's legendaries to get in post-game. And then I tried to start getting, you know, these post-game legendaries. And then once I realized what you actually had to do, I'm like, this is, n no, this is too much grinding for me. I'm done. It was dumb. I did not want to do it. I, I found Brilliant Diamond, Shining Pearl to be mediocre. But it is what it is. I'm glad you're having fun at the very least. Uh, by the way, have you ever played Legends Arceus? We got another 5% encounter rate. I could bump it to 7, but... Eh. Still has bad pains of classic Pokemon games that I really dislike. Uh, for me, it's just more of it's an underwhelming remake, and I don't think it looks good either. So we get a Legends Arceus. That was such a game. Oh, so you have played it. Yeah, that, that was fun to play. I wish it had more time to cook. Yeah. Like, Legends Arceus was a fun game to play. It just needed to be... It just needed to stay in the oven a little bit longer. That's all. But no, we have to have a Pokemon game like, what, two months after Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl? Right. Although, in Legends, Ar uh, Legends Arceus, you still had to go to a guy to transfer, uh, swap your Pokemon out. At least it makes sense within the world. Whereas when you play Sword Shield and uh, Scarlet and Violet, you can just go into your menu and just swap them out at any time you want. Yeah. And Legends Arceus is just fun to run around and just catch things, you know? Yeah, in, in Sword Shield, Scarlet and Violet, the access to the PC is just in your, in your menu, in your pause menu, pretty much. So you could just swap at any time. You don't have to go to a Pokemon Center. Graphical stuff. Yeah, the, it's graphical stuff with Legends Arceus. Mostly. Other than that, I don't really have much complaints. Other than maybe lack of some content, maybe. It's more of like, if it had longer to cook, it, there'd probably be more content to it. But with what's there, it's mostly graphical and uh, uh, frame... Not frame rate? Maybe frame rate. But, you know, technical stuff that they could fix. And now we're going to get Legend Z. I don't have much to say on it because we don't have an actual trailer. But, hey, I like Legends Arceus. Here we go. Here's the fight. Okay. Let's see. Come Guardian. It's that guy that's attacking right now. Oh, he survived. 
Come on. Wood powder. I think that's it. I think that was the chip. Yep, here it is. Wood powder. How come these two are weaker than the blizzard one? It's because they, like, crack panels and stuff. Okay. So that's done. Didn't need to use a lock enemy. Let me look at what chips I need. I need eight more. This one we need to buy. This one we could try getting a meteor comp. We don't have to get in a meteor comp. But I think that's probably one of our better shots. This one we have to buy. This one I believe is a bug frag dealer. So we're going to be taking a little bit to get that one. Uh, let me pull up this list. Uh, 126. Okay. Bug Frag Trader. We can get it in Netopia from a Green Mystery Data, though. So there is a chance we could get it through there. We have to buy these two, Slow Gauge and Fast Gauge, and the Undernet 1 Net Dealer. Undernet 5 Dealer. Which costs money. And Bug Frag Trader. Okay. Let's go to Meteor Comp. Let's try to find Boy Bomb. We will gather blue mystery data while we're there as well. This might as well. We will not fight Duo. We can fight R Laser Man, though. That's not a big deal. So, Juice, I gotta ask. When you played through Battle Network 4, did you end up going through the game four times to get all of the navvies unlocked, or did you just do the three playthroughs? Oh, you know what? Let me pull up my... List. Not Black Earth. I want Meteor Comp. Okay. Wait. I don't think I'm in the right one. No, I'm not in the right one. Okay, here we go. Hold on. Meteor Comp. All right, three, three of them. I think you have a fourth playthrough ready with all the redstone ready to go. Oh, okay. But you didn't do it on, on the stream. I see. I mean, I get it. I mean, going through the game just two extra times is already tedious. But I'm going through it anyway. We'll probably get all the Navi stuff and everything else done on that fourth playthrough. I was going to save base, but no, if I want to get access to Black Earth for blue mystery data, I have to do it now. That's why I'm doing it. That's really the only reason. Oh, damn. Come on. And as you can see, Juice, I have still learned the power of Reflect. It is still good. See? Still good. Multiple playthroughs hurts. <laughs> Yeah, you, you have shown me the power of Reflect for Battle Network 3. Not 2. It's not good in 2. Hell, you can't you can't reflect in 2. Reg up 1. Okay. It's so good. It's better than that anti-magic. 
Oh yeah. Uh, one bug fragment. Okay. I believe that's all the blue mystery data. Yeah, the, honestly, it is the thing that hurts this game. The reason why people say this is like the worst or the second worst is due to the multiple playthroughs. There's no other reason. Actually, we'll go, we'll go here. Oh. Well, I have Gun Soul EX. Okay, I lost. It's fine. And every time travels, you can inflict so much damage. I know, right? Oh, yeah, the Plant Man fight was, like, so good with Reflect because of how often he just spammed that needle attack. Because he spammed it so often, it was just easy to just reflect, reflect, reflect. I don't know how good Reflect is for a lot of navvies in this game, but it still have, has been super useful. So, if I'm correct, you were playing through Blue Moon. Uh, do you have a favorite? Uh, what was kind of your build for your folder? Slash, uh, uh, sorry. Favorite souls to use if you end up using them. It's all good. You don't have to. Gun Soul EX. Oh, you used, you went Metal Man Air Hockey. Okay. You see, I have Air Hockey, but I'm not... Uh, I have not used up Metal Man at all. Like, Air Hockey's in my folder. It was never not gonna be in my folder. But the Metal Soul, I have not used. Down for trades. Um. What, do you need something for a trade? <laughs> yeah, uh, I mean, you're you're somewhat correct on that one. But no, no, it has its own collection. Because Capcom wants their own money. If only needed. Now, uh, the multiplayer stuff and all the trading was really needed for uh, 2 and 3, really. Let me look at my. So yeah, Zenny, Rega, Bug Frag, we got all that. Okay, three more uh, blue mystery data in area two. Unless you wanted to compare folders, but that's about it. We got Bug Fix. That's a that's a mega chip. Is that real? No, I thought I had. I thought I had bug fix before. Oh yeah, there it is. I had bug fix, but now it's a star code. That that that's a way better one. 
That's a way better code. Oh, wait. Grab that. HP memory? We're getting there. Move down. Move down. There you go. But I, I can show you my folder a little bit. But uh, some of these are just kind of here. But the main ones are like these White Shot 3s, uh, Air Hawks 3s, uh, and Boomer 3s. Because they're all the U these U chips. Gun Soul is here because it's just a useful one. I have two healing chips, two invis. I still have my two attack plus 10s. Super Vulcan, Guardian, Gun Soul, Pricks Power, Duo. I have Magnet Bolt 3 because it's it's here. I don't honestly don't know. Bubble side to go into Aqua Soul. Because honestly, the times two attack for Aqua Chips is still useful. And Vulcan if I go into Number Soul. And also it's multi-hit, so it's very useful. That's kind of my folder. It can be changed up a little bit. But overall, I'm okay with my folder. But yeah, all the all the multiplayer stuff that the games had you do to get like secret chips or Battle Network 3 it was to get a giga chip. Uh they stopped doing that after three. I'm kinda glad. But if you wanted to fight your other navvies, you still need multiple people. Now, uh, let's heal. There we go. Finder 3. Blue mystery data? Zenny. Okay, we need to grab the third one. One more planet. I'll say this, like, yeah, it sucks playing through the game multiple times, but because the only thing that changes is who you're fighting during the tournaments, you can easily skip a lot of cutscenes. So it does make the other playthroughs just go a lot faster. It's still tedious, though. Still very tedious. Okay. Alright, three more blue mystery data. Nothing there. There's one. Can't get to it. Here's another. One bug fragment. I think Boy Bomb 3 is in the fourth area. At least I think so. One. It's 
stupid gravity well. There's the two. How do I get there? Come, Guardian. 400 damage. Uh, just S chips. Area locking, bodyguard combo. Oh, yeah. That's probably going to change my folder up if I have bodyguard. Sanctuary, aura, life sword. And air hockey three for the program advance. Because. You can't have it be too broken, you know? I went the wrong way. Mystery data? Zenny. But you were mostly going with an S folder. Interesting. But yeah, bodyguard is the big factor right there, isn't it? <laughs> that, that was the big change. The big reason of going for it. I got rid of one. There we go. Especially a full synchro, yeah. Oh my god. Full full synchro bodyguard. It'll still be the most broken program advance. And yet they keep bringing it back. But no, air hockey needs a nerf. I mean, look, air hockey is very good. <laughs> I am not denying that. But bodyguard is still really good, and they still haven't nerfed it. As far as I know, I haven't tried it out in this run. Ah, uh, that uh, this is this is awful. I'm not gonna make it through this. Okay, fine. I'll live. Well, no, I gotta get him over, but yeah, whatever. Liberation, yeah, make, I kind of wish they did try it again, but they took it out in six. Maybe it's because people didn't, did people not like Liberation Missions? Was that the reason? It is just, it just become, it does become a tactics game out of left field, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm getting rid of you. Like, I like the Liberation Missions. I kind of wish they tried it again, but they kind of just gave up, didn't they? I need some healing. Yeah, I, I think the consensus was it wasn't really that popular. I don't have, I don't have Pile Driver. I'm trying to look for some healing chips right now. Oh yeah, I still have collect, so I'm not going to be getting healing after battle, that's for sure. Okay. Well, here's one. Definitely need that. 
It is kind of weird that just out of the blue, they threw in a tactics game in my Battle Network game. I mean, I think they pulled it off well, but it is kind of weird. The power of the sun shall delete you! I'm making a save. We go this way. There we go. I grabbed all the mystery data, right? Right? No, I didn't. I, I don't recognize one. I did not grab one of them. Down here. There it is. Long blade R. I can't see where they're going. Damn. Super Vulcan it is. Let's just use normal Vulcan. Starter step? Starter step? Please work. There we go. We got rid of the boy bomb. Um, let's heal up. I'm gonna get rid of the fan, because why not? And reflect. We can use the power of the sun. Still love Gun Soul. Okay. Area four. There's four blue mystery data. And I think we find Boy Bomb here, but I could be wrong. If we don't find Boy Bomb, we're probably gonna have to go to like Undernet. Wind Rack Star. Okay. Um, let's start with this. Got rid of got rid of two of them. Oh no, slow gauge. That's actually really annoying. And I could take him out with this. With boomerang. Because my time's two. Get out of here. Of course it's Big Hammer. Why wouldn't... Why would it be Big Bomb? Boy Bomb. Blue mystery data, full energy. Oh, times two, baby. There we go, what do we get? Big hammer again? That's not what I need. Yeah, we have to go back and around for three. Bug fragments. Um. Gonna wait for the other one. 
want to... Oh, I managed to kill him with a Reflect. That's, that's very nice. That is very nice. Um... One. One more reflect will do the trick. Oh, oops. Can I heal? Nope. Can't heal. But we have Prick's power. Let me guess. It's the hammer? No, it's Boy Bomb 3! Let's take a look at that library very quick. Okay, we buy this one. Just double checking. One, two, and three. There we go. We buy this one. Bug Frag Trader, maybe Green Mystery Data and Netopia. We buy these in Undernet. Undernet five. Bug Frag Trader, Undernet. Okay! We got Boy Bomb three. We don't need collect, as far as I'm aware. Uh, do I want to put custom in? Maybe. I don't need collect. I don't think I need any of this. Anything else. I could throw in a speed. Actually, I might just throw in a charge. HP. Yeah. There we go. That should work. All systems normal. Alright. Making a save. Let's just clear out this area. We got a bunch of zenny. Let me go up here. We might as well just defeat Laser Man because why not? We're here. Might as well defeat him. That way, when we come back, we could just go straight for the final boss. Down here. Ah, stupid gravity well thing. Okay, up here. Okay, come on. I can use the power of the sun. There we go. And we're gonna get some zenny out of these now. Number three. Let's keep going. Four is somewhere over here. I think. There it is. Let's go with air hockey. Don't you love a times two air hockey? Did did I walk past the conveyor belt? Hold on. Okay, maybe I already went through it. That was just weird. Oh, and we have to go all the way around to get to the five. Yeah, that just looked very weird. I thought I walked around the conveyor belt and not actually taking it. It looked weird to me.
I mean, this game is already kind of glitching on me a little bit here and there. We had the disappearing Navi. Um, how do I want to handle this? You know what? Let's have Super Vulcan. How much do I have to redo? Okay, we did the third one. Let's save. We did four. Times two. We don't have any anything that drastic. Okay. Get out of here. What are you gonna try to do? Let's heal up. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> his own rocks destroyed it. Oh, I needed that. Get out of here. This way? Let me get a save. To the left. Up. And over. There we go. We got all the planets. We have the way to the boss opened. Windrack, Zenny, full energy, bug fragment. I want to say I got all the mystery data. I'm pretty sure I got it all. But now I'm like second guessing myself. I'm getting rid of the boy bomb. Before he does anything. Get out of here. And I could just keep reflecting. Oh no. I, I can't see... Whatever will I do? I can't see these guys. It was dangerous when it comes to, like, the boy bomb when I couldn't see him, but none of these guys move. Alright. I think I got it all. Let's get rid of Laser Man. All right, Laser Man. I am going to show you the power of Reflect. Okay. The power of Reflect compels you. Might as well get the healing in. Okay, this is actually a little bit dangerous. It's actually sometimes hard to tell uh, how many rocks are about to fall. Um. Hmm. Let's get rid of the one. Oh, nope. Get out of the way. Get rid of these. 
There. I'm not letting you get rid of my... My reflex strats. And air hockey. Okay. I get prep for that. However... Let's get rid of these. Oh no, he gets uh, regen. So first, let's actually start with this. I want him here. See, look how dangerous that is. And... Come, Guardian. Get out of here. All right, we defeated Laser Man. We could continue with the plot. I'm out of here. We got all the blue mystery data there. We got Boy Bomb. Now for the money grind. I think that's the best thing to do. How much money do I have? Okay. Money grind. Hopefully we get more bug fragments because apparently I need it. We might... Okay. Let's just start at... My PC. Alright. Untrap. Save. We're gonna take Dex's uh, shortcut. We're gonna go to Yumland. We're gonna grab Grim Green Mystery Data and Yumland, then Netopia, then Netfrica, and then onto Undernet, and you know, so on and so forth. We might as well check out the Net Dealer in Netopia while we're there. Let's see if we can grab the two. as well try to get this green mystery data. There we go. Got him. More Zenny. Bug fragment. Definitely need more of that. Off to Yumland. Check out every green mystery data. See if we get some extra Zenny. I think there's only two, so I think we're good. This is the money grinding session right now. Can I run? Okay, good. I know I need Zenny, but I didn't really want to do that particular fight with that loadout. I believe there's always just two green mystery data every time you enter. I think. Could be wrong. Can I get rid of both? Nope, just the one. Oh, and not even just the one. Come on. This is me not paying attention. Yeah, perfect. I can't remember. I remember how in Battle Network 5. Isn't Battle Network 5 you just do a liberation mission, get one of the Zenny panels, and then just retreat and start over? Like, isn't that the money making scheme in 5?
Honestly, so far... Okay, that was the strat. Honestly, in this, I just think it's untrap and then go into these later areas. Just get a bunch of money. Like, mainly under net. If there is a better way to get money, I would like to know. But for now, this is the only, the only thing I know of to get money. Alright, what do we got? We need repair. And we need slasher. Just green mystery data? Okay. Well, if this is the strat, this is the strat. Uh, gotta find the other green mystery data here. We got two more chips for the library. So that's good. Come, Guardian. Twin Fang. Where's the other green? It's probably on the way to Netfrica. And by the way, I have not... Uh, gotten any of the navvies unlocked except for Shade Man. Because, you know, when you do that side quest, you have to get Shade Man. Or, yeah, Shade Man. I was just kind of avoiding the navvies. One, I didn't want to just deal with them randomly. And two, I didn't really have a good folder for them until kind of now. Now I have a better folder. I could kind of take them on. But I was also going to just save them for, you know, later. There it is. More Zenny. I really hate Undernet 1 and 2, but we have to go in there. <laughs> oh, wait. If I want a green mystery data, I should check that uh, corner. Of course I get hit. Okay, I really need to heal now. Get rid of you first. Kinda wish I didn't waste both the boomerangs now. Yeah, I need to heal up. Number soul. I'm gonna look for that last boomerang. Heal up on the grass panels while I have the chance. Really wish I had fast gauge. But no! I still need to buy it. There we go. There it is. And Super Vulcan just to style, I guess. Let's get my health back. What, you can't catch up to me? a lot of damage. And there we go. Yeah, it wasn't for the Zenny, even though I still need Zenny, but really just to try to get my health back. More Zenny, good. That's where I'm mainly getting my Zenny. Honestly, Zenny from battles, like, it really doesn't give you that much.
Okay, got rid of one. Get rid of you. Right now. I don't remember recovery the grass being that good with whistle. Yeah, it really is very fast. It outspeeds uh, poison from a poison tile. Like, the healing from Wood Soul is faster than losing health from poison. So, it is that good. Definitely worth considering if you're in desperately, uh, desperate need of health. Okay. More Zenny. Off to Undernet. Alright. I really hate Undernet 1. Mostly do 1 and 2, mostly due to spiders, but, you know, it is what it is. Okay, can I buy anything? Yes. Let's get rid of. Let's get Fast Gauge right now. We will need to come back and buy Slow Gauge, but I don't have the money. We also need anti-navy. See, look what I'm talking about. It's the spiders again. Can I run? Please. Let me do Thank you. I don't like the spiders. More zenny. Perfect. Make a save. Honestly, I feel like the spiders is my most, like... Is it my most dreaded enemy, like, normal virus that I hate fighting? I feel like it might be one of them. The spiders feel like it to me, anyway. It's like, oh no, the spiders, get me out of here! Or at least in a case like this, be like, oh, get him out of here. Frick's power. Just immediately. I don't want to deal with you. The healing from grass tiles versus the poison from Anubis? That's a good question. I don't know the answer to that. I almost want to test it out. Big Hammer 3. Not that useful. There. I can get rid of it. X power! On grass, an enemy uses Anubis. Yeah, if the Poison Pharaoh uh, is just as fast as the healing from a Wood Soul, then you probably just stay at the HP you're on, right? It'll probably tick up or tick down, but then it'll just keep uh, keep doing that. Okay. I want to try to run. It'd be interesting to test out. Too bad there's no grass stage. You know what I mean? It's all good. Undernet 3. One green mystery data. One more. We want to go to Undernet 5. And there's the second green one. Buck Fragment. Alright. I 
I kind of think going to six is too much of a detour. You're going to be playing tons of Pokemon this next week? Very nice. Very nice. By the way, uh, uh, I think I missed your, like, last Pokemon stream. How far did you get? Where are you at right now in Brilliant Diamond? Okay, under net four. Where's the green mystery data? Not up there. I think that's where the blue was, so I don't think I ever need to go back that way. Huh. Where is the green? Go back to five later. There's one. There's the other. 3,000 zenny. Head to the third la uh, lake. Ah, you're on your way to Snow Point. Oh, I'm getting Dr. Pepper ads, huh? Interesting. Um, I run. I don't wanna. I don't wanna fight either of you. I think getting that one HP memory is making it easier for me to run. It's like that one extra level. Now everything's easy. Okay, for, I'm, I'm saving periodically because I don't want to fight Shade Man right now. Bug frag trader. I need Navi plus 20, but I do not have the bug frags. I also need this, but I definitely do not have the bug fragments. There is a chance we could get get in three in Netopia, apparently. Let's just hope we could get that. Honestly, bug frags is probably what we're gonna have to grind for. Ooh, I do not like this. Can I run? Under net five. Now we're safe from Shade Man. I don't have this place memorized right now. That was the purple mystery data. <laughs> oh, I need that green. But that spider. No, I don't like this. Get out of here. Oh, no. Nope. Never mind. I'm stuck here. Watch me lose because of the spider. Well, I'm definitely not getting the green mystery there, that's for sure. Um, but yeah, you're on your way to Snow Point. Very nice. I really hate these spiders so much. Okay. Let's heal up. Now it's safe. Yeah, hunt out a few more Pokemon to name. Yeah, I know. Like, you need to... Uh, what'd you say you need to go after? You need to go after Snowrunt uh, and Snubble, right? Or Swinub. Not Snubble. Swinub. What else do you need to hunt for in Snow Point? By the way, do you remember how to get Mammal Swine? Uh... Oh, exactly. Because of my glorious beard. Uh, exactly. Um, grab all the 
this. No, I can't think of anything else. Uh, one thing I will make a suggestion to you, once you get to Snow Point, go into the underground. I need this healing. Uh, you're gonna want to try to find an item that's in the underground within that top left area. Trust me, you'll want it. Oh, you're gonna get a deli bird? Very cool. Wait, can you get deli bird in? I don't remember finding deli bird. Is deli bird in, in that? Uh, I don't remember Deli Bird. I mean, you know what? Let me look. Like, I know Deli Bird can be in the game through, like, transfer at the very least, but I don't remember you being able to find one. You know, let me look. I could be very wrong. I just don't remember. Um... Oh, okay. Yeah, it's here. Route 216 and the Grand... Wait, which one's 216? Oh, yeah. Okay, there you go. It is there. How do you find it? Oh, um... It's a swarm. And I think swarms are post-game. I knew something wasn't right. We're in, uh, but you can go into the Grand Underground. Let me check. Is there a way to... I see cave. I see cave. Rare spawns. Yeah... You're gonna have to wait for post game for Della Bird. I'm sorry. I just checked the underground. You need post game. Hey, Monzai, what's going on? We got mine ship. Okay. Uh, so, Monza, right now, apparently if I need to get into Black Earth, which I kind of need to for blue mystery data, apparently I have to beat base. So, and to get to base, I need money. And to fill out the standard ships, dealing with the last few things for your trip. Oh, yeah. Again, I hope that all goes well and you get everything for you. Uh, what's your question, Juice? What is the question you have to a to ask me on this Friday and on stream? Post game for Brilliant Diamond. The same post game as Platinum? Uh, can you be a little bit more specific in what you're asking? Are you asking about the distortion world or are you asking a few other things? Um, I think it, I'm trying to remember if it did have the distortion world. I don't think it did. It's a faithful remake of Diamond and Pearl, more or less. That's what I found to make money is... Find a battle with mystery data and lock enemy. Otherwise, go around the internet with untrap on. So that's currently what I'm doing, is the untrap one. But, yeah. Distortion world. Um, maybe that was the only thing they added? Hold on. Pokemon. EDSP dis... Maybe that was like the only platinum thing they added. I can't remember. Nope, no distortion world, and there's also no battle frontier. Or 
Or maybe there is. I don't. Wait. Come on. Nope. No distortion world. It's a faithful recreation of Diamond and Pearl. And everything that means. <laughs> you know, everything that would imply. Other than, you know, fixing the underground. That's not a faithful recreation. That's just improving it. But, you know, we can't have too many good things in Pokemon games. You know, we can't have that. We can't, we're not allowed to have nice things in Pokemon anymore. Oh, I thought it was up there. Okay, I am just... I am just dying. There we go. Trade up a Delaberto unless there's a bit of post game. Uh, when it comes to post game, I spent a few hours grinding for Bug Frags in three. Oh yeah, Bug Frags in three are a lot easier to get. Uh, you just need to counter guys, and Reflect was very good at that. Up to 18k, yeah, or 1800, yeah. Um. I know, Juice, you can trade a... If you have Pokemon Home and stuff, you can get a Deli Bird into the game. It is possible. I can't get away. Got, got rid of one of them. What to do now? Sure. Well, that's something. Running around in the armor statue? Like throwing, uh, I actually just went to the dog house. You know, before uh, freaking Beastman shows up. Because when Beastman shows up, that's when it becomes a problem. Uh, what's the best way for Bug Fragments at this point in 4? Because I'm going to need to do Bug Frag grinding as well. Easy Bug Fragments. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I know. Like, I was trying to find Beastman so much, but, like, he just would not show up. And I needed, like, to fight him that one time for the cube. Like, it was ridiculous. Okay. I can buy Anti-Navi. I really want this, but I can't get it yet. Find blue mystery data, lock enemy it. Or green mystery data, lock enemy, beast man fly out. Yeah, ex oh, that's the thing. I used sneak run, and he still wouldn't show up. I have evidence of this. He just did not want to show up at all. He was kind of a coward that way. Um, okay. Let me look at my... I need three more chips. Bug Frag Trader or, um, uh, Green Mystery Data in Netopia. Gotta buy this one in under, under Net 1. Bug frag trader. Well, let's get a little bit more money, I guess. Let's do another money run. We almost got every standard chip. So, is there. Uh, 
So for bug fragments, I'm going to need to find a fight with green mystery data. Is there a particular fight that you have in mind that's a pretty good one? Like, Undernet 5, Undernet 6. Look for a specific fight. That's just not too hard, but also gives... If, if I keep the mystery data, it gives a good reward. Where's the other green? There's one more here somewhere. Hey, okay, Juice, if you really want Delibird in your playthrough, you're probably going to have to transfer it up from some other game. And, uh... And just go through Pokemon Home. Hell, you can use Pokemon Go. But yeah, if you really want Delibird on your normal playthrough, you would have to use uh, post-game. Or I am... I could... Uh, I am in post-game. If you really need a Delibird, I could probably get you one if you want. I could trade you one. Ooh, buck. That was a blue Mystery Data Bug Fragment. I didn't grab that one. Okay. Although, I'm wondering when you can connect to home in Diamond and Pearl. I know you can, I just don't, don't know when it allows you. Yeah, if you really want a Delibird, I could get you one. I am in post-game. It allows world trades after the first gym be the same rules for home. I'm probably. I don't know. You would have to try. I can't make one. Let's go gun soul. I only did a little bit on this guy, but it's something. Get my health back. Ah, dang it! That was that was dumb. That was a waste of a heal. Oh, by the way, I when I was looking up stuff for Battle Network yesterday, at some point during my playthrough, I made like a theory that Tora was in the Red Sun tournament because he's a representative of Sharo. Apparently, I looked it up. Taro is a uh, Kingman's na uh, nav operator is not part of Sharo. He, I guess, he's from Swapopolis. I guess. So no, he's not from Sharo. So that theory does not work. It was a good idea, though, but no, he's not from Sharo. I made this big theory that it's just like, oh, he's from Sharo, and, and the reason why we didn't see him is because he took place in the other tournament that Sharo uh, set up. And he won that tournament, and he's the one piloting, but no, that's... He's not from Sharo. I mean, he could have taken place in that tournament, but we don't know. He's only in three. Yeah, he says he's in. Sw he's from Swapopolis in three. I just got that confused with Sharo. Because when I replayed three, when I did the stream, I forgot what Sharo was called. 
And I thought it was the same place. But no, Swapopolis, I guess, is like the next town over from Den City, <laughs> I guess. Yeah, we we have no clue who's piloting the what was it, the satellite for, from the the Sharo tournament. Could be Moss. Yeah, we have no clue who took part in that tournament. I want to know who took part in that tournament. Honestly, I almost want this game to get some sort of remake. Like, if Battle Network ever gets ever got a remake, it never would. But imagine if this game got some sort of remake. I would want an expansion on what happened on that other tournament. Like who who went it who entered it and who won? That would be interesting to find out. Rush? The dog virus? The dog virus entered the the blue moon or red sun tournament? And won somehow. I don't know if who would be the funniest winner. That's a good question. You gotta think of every other guy that has shown up in a previous Battle Network game and who hasn't shown back up in this to take place in any of the other tournaments. There's a lot of people. What if it was Color Man? It wouldn't make sense, but <laughs> what if it was Color Man? It's just like, I'm going to pilot the satellite. Oh no, we're screwed. <laughs> and then crashes the satellite into the planet. Probably can't be any of the World 3 representatives. Unless they have, like, turned over a new leaf. And I doubt Color Man's operator would have. Still work on... Oh, right. Yeah, get some Mega Man X connection in here. That would be cool. It's kind of sad that Color Man is one of the main villains of one. Never appeared again. Magic Man 2. Well, okay. Not necessarily never appeared again. If you, uh, I mean, that is, do you count network transmission and battle chip challenge? Do you count those two games? If you don't, then no, he hasn't shown up ever since Battle Network 1. Yeah. I wouldn't. But Magic Man, no, he hasn't shown up other than Battle Chip Challenge. Electman well, Man reappeared, but not Count Zap. Uh, it's not through Count Zap, though. But he do uh, Elect Man does come back. You're right about that. It's so weird that Match is only... It no it he doesn't show up in a single game. I'm almost upset, but I'm also glad for the slight variety. You know what I mean? I like the variety, but it's also like, come on, he's in every game. And as far as we know, there's only two operators that have a fire navy. Okay, wait, if we count Battle Chip Challenge, I think Turbo Man is considered a fire navy, so three. Or at least it has a fire attack, I'm not sure. There are three navvies, three fire navvies, that have operators that are not owned by Mr. Match. Mr. Match has a monop almost a monopoly of every fire navvy. All right, we got slow gauge. Now for bug fragments. Yeah, the whole Cyber Pe Peacock thing. Um, you gotta remember, Cyber Peacock in the Mega Man X universe is like a, hu a hundred years after the classic games, which would mean a hundred years after Battle Network. But this is an alternate universe, so you could 
like, make it work somehow, I guess. He threw a temper tantrum. Yeah, when someone else had when someone else had burn man or burner man, whatever. Might as well grab this. More Zenny is always good. I still need the HP memories. Can I head out? Alright. Alright, have a good stream, Monzai. Good luck with whatever you're playing. Oh no, I can't run from spiders. Oh, oh, that was close. I really need to get to area two. Oh, I managed to make it work. Max HP, good. Okay, if we're gonna want blue mystery or bug fragments, we're gonna have to find a good green mystery data fight in one of these undernet areas, most likely. Maybe hang out in an undernet 5 and see what we can find there. Maybe undernet 6, I'm not sure. But once we find a good one, we're gonna stick with it. Can I get this one? Yeah. But yeah, they could totally do a... Imagine if Battle Network got another, like, reboot series. Whether it's, like, you continue Battle Network or you make, like, a separate series like Star Force. Just make another one. But it, uh, the, the bosses are adaptations of the Mavericks from the X series. Like, imagine if they did that. And when they get to Cyber Peacock, they they can just say it's the same one. He just transferred from a different universe. But he's like the only one that would apply to. Oh God. I need healing. Good pile driver. That'll work. Yeah, get out of here. We need two more chips. Two more. Because Star Force does its own, uh, its own original boss designs. So, like, it doesn't even do anything like a Mega Man X adaptations. And I'm okay with that. I mean, Star Force takes place 200 years after Battle Network. What if you had a uh, in between new series? Battle Network 2. <laughs> Point oh, I guess. I don't know. And it and it just adapts uh, Mega Man X Mavericks into Navis. Cause why not? I don't know. I wouldn't mind seeing what Spark Mandrill looks like as a Navi. Although, if there's a trend when it comes to Navis, Navis kind of have like that, uh... Oh, what's the look? It's like they're wearing yoga pants or something all the time, and then they just have like some bulky to torso. You can kind of see a pattern with some of their designs in Battle Network.
let's see. Can I run? I don't want to fight this. It'd be like Super Navi's way stronger and harder. Yeah. You could definitely do something with adaptations of the Mavericks. Maybe. Uh, I don't have enough, do I? I need like 10 more. Like, the explanation could be. Like, th those are just the new versions of Navi's. People are not into whatever you would call what these are based on. Like, elements or like things. They want navvies that are based on animals. That's just what the people want. You know, like, I, I guess you could explain it that way. So that's why, that's why navvies would look more like animals, like in the X games. can't run. Oh, no. It's not a hard fight, but I just don't like fighting the sheep. Okay. Let's look for green. All right. Let, ugh, I need bug fragments. Let's see if we can find a fight in in this area that can get me that. We're gonna look for a green mystery data in the fight. Then we're gonna lock enemy and get as many many of those as we possibly can. Cause I can't fight you, but I have to fight you. Nope, not this fight. Just keep running back and forth until we find something. I mean, this is a, a fight I might need to do, but I'm not in a good situation. I might try to get a times two multiplier on a one of these fights. And then run. If I find a good one. Come on, let me run. Okay, good. Just always stand three squares away from those guys, and you'll just dodge the attack. Like, this is a decent fight to get the times two multiplier. See, I got it. Now, can I run? No, I can't. Ah, dang it. I was trying. I was trying. Maybe I should win the fight. I don't know. this work. Hold on. Got Super Vulcan, but no Invis. If I can get a times two somehow. What would be a good way to do that? These two right here will do it. Let's just use up some chips. I gotta waste the number soul now.
Oh, this is perfect. This is perfect. Look at this. Now he can't do anything. He lost his wool. There we go. Now if I want times two, I wanna do this. There we go. He can't do anything. I have times two. I'm at full health. I can Mega Buster. Okay. I am going to save. There we go. Now if I find a fight that I want to see if I could try to get a chip in, I'm gonna... And I have a good starting lineup, I can try it. Like this one. Oh, just like this one. Perfect. Double delete. That's an... I can... I, I can use pit hockey. Oh, no. We have the most broken program advance. There we go. There we go. I still kind of like keeping them all the same code because honestly, air hockey by itself is still pretty good. But air hockey with program advance, oh, it it just destroys everything. Come on, let me run. Thank you. Is there any fight with the green mystery data here? Because maybe I'm wasting my time. Let me check something. I go here. Okay. There is a fight. There are two fights in this area that have green mystery data. We are talking about a 7% chance. However, what I could do to give myself a shot of finding it, a better shot anyway, we throw in jungle. Try it now. This is like a now. This is now like a 17%. I think there's one fight I would prefer over the other. And it's not this. I'm just gonna title screen it. Because I don't want to do that fight. Internet 5. This is the fight I want. This is the fight. So, what we could do is set this up first. Oh. Maybe this is not the fight I want. Maybe I have a better shot with the other fight. the other fight I mean it's annoying but maybe it might be better on kind of want to just get an idea of what I might be dealing with this is the other one it 
if I can just get rid of... Oh, I had times two... I just realized I had times two guardian. I could have done that. With this one, I could do a better job of not destroying the green mystery data. Apparently, uh, Gun Soul was not fast enough. And you know what? We'll do this fight. We'll do this one. Okay, first, I still have times two. Let's adjust my folder. Okay, custom two. Get my attack. Attack, and then my charge. There we go. System's normal. Lock enemy. Alright, let's try it. I might have a better time not destroying the the green mystery data on this one. We'll see. Depends on who who I could take out first. Let's see. Times two air hockey. I could get rid of that one guy first. mind I'll get I'll take the hit there we go one more perfect I rather have the health and we got three bug fragments okay let's keep it going Keep this going. Not this fight. I did save after the green after the green mystery data, so I can just reset every time. I need twenty eight for Navi plus twenty. Just double checking. Here we go. I do not have times two, so that's going to be a problem. Now what to do? What do I do now? Got rid of one. Wait, is the spider stuck there? The spider might be stuck there. He was stuck there until I moved. Okay. There we go. Health max, I'll take it. Meta gel. No. I'm going to reload saves. Because I want I only want bug fragments. The fact that the spider was stuck there was actually really useful. It let me just ignore him for a little while. But I guess the uh, the issue right now is trying to get rid of one of the met 
one of the Mets. If I could get rid of one. Nope. This is this is just gonna be what what this is right now. I'm hoping to beat base. Go into Black Earth. And maybe beat duo. We'll we'll see if that works. All right, we at least get rid of the spider, and that's good enough for me. Okay. Uh, I can use Gun Soul if I want. But I don't think I will. Oh, that was close. Perfect. Three bug fragments. We'll take it. We're going to gather as many bug fragments as I can before lock enemy runs out. Actually, I might just run down closer to the Undernet 4 section. That way we can easily leave the area and head towards the Bug Frag Trader. Here we go. How do I want to handle this? How do I like this? I can keep that spider there. Oh, wait. He just, just... Oh, come on. Okay, after a while, he just teleports back. Mmm, that, that's stupid. Granted, I lost the, the mystery data because I didn't stop the other Met. Oh, well. It is what it is. Okay. I can gun soul, but I have to make sure this guy attacks first. I'll eat the hits. Okay, that's fine. Actually, we'll start with Invis. Get out of here. Come on. Okay, we got healing. Bug fragments. Perfect. One more set, and I can get Navi plus 20. Nope. Not this fight. Let's get as many bug fragments as possible. I got him before he got the kill. Sanctuary. I was about to get rid of the spider, but that didn't work. All right. I 
damage. Let's get some of my health back, I guess. Nope, I don't want mine. This is still, like, only three bug fragments. A far cry from Battle Network 3 where we could get eight. It's a far cry. Uh, what to do? I have times two now. Oh no, Sanctuary, that's actually really bad. It's actually really bad. Take my best shot. Oh, I lucked out. Okay, how do I get rid of you? He's too work. Never mind. Dang it. It's a freaking sanctuary. I still don't understand why they got rid of grass stage as well as ice stage, lava stage, metal stage. They could have kept them. Did they think it was too broken? times two I could deal a lot of damage but I could just get rid of the spider right now get rid of the spider that's the big threat still don't understand why kendo man only attacks one enemy Bug fragments. Okay. I now have enough for Navi plus 20. We're gonna keep going until lock enemy ends. I'm pretty sure it has a certain amount of steps before it runs out. Just like normal. I think I have to gun soul. Oh, come on. I I thought I moved down fast enough. I guess this is how you bug frag grind, but even then, it's still not that fast. Couldn't even be could be way better. The other option is to just keep doing multiple playthroughs and grab all the blue mystery data because at that point, pretty much all of them are just going to be, uh, are just going to be bug fragments. Now I could get rid of the spider. So the explanation of Prick's power is that these are the winners of the tournaments. So it's implying that the canon winners of the Hawk tournament is Video Man and the winner of uh, the Blue Moon Red Sun tournament is Kendo Man. 
so who's the can of winner of the oh. lock enemy expired all right who's the canon winner of the of like the den tournament then because yeah laser man's here but it's the explanation is video man just kind of summons him creates a copy it's not actually laser man's not actually there so who's the canon winner of den tournament it has to be one of it it's either Top Man or Spark Man. That's the explanation I have. That's kind of what I'm getting out of this. All right. One more chip. We have to get it from from this guy. Right here, 50 bug frags. However, I'm going to see if I can find if it's actually in green mystery data. Okay. Under net. No, I want uh, net Netopia. Get in three. I see it. I think I think we're gonna hunt in Netopia actually. How many untraps do I have? Three? Okay. Let's just hunt in Netopia. Like for this last one. I don't really want to go bug frag grinding right now. I mean I will have to, but I don't want to do it right now. Topia. Two bug fragments, or two green mystery data somewhere. Where are you? I will need to make another money, money grinding trip. Okay, what are you? Bug fragment. We'll take it. I need it. Yeah, I'm gonna use my money for HP memories for right now. Right, where is the other green? Let's try it. Was that anti water? Hey, we're getting more bug frags out of this. It's going to help for later. As many as I could possibly get. And what is this one? Is any? I wonder, it's probably in a, the green mystery data might actually just be in a very specific spot because I think this one's always sand ring. Mega energy bomb, Never mind. Okay, we'll just keep going. Okay, I lucked out there. I'm not gonna use untrap. Unless I already know it's going to be a virus. Because I can buy more in traps, that's not a big deal. More Zenny, see? That's like... That's ton of traps right there. Is there... A map? 
where it lists all the mystery yeah no not really at least not on that site well just gonna keep going come on get in three There's just two random green mystery data somewhere. Okay, I know where they both are. Zenny? Okay. Virus? And you know, if it's a virus, it is just Zenny. And I do need it. I could go in one more time before I need to go buy on un traps. Now this is a different get in code than the one that the bug frag trader gives you. But hey, the the library does not care. Okay, there's one down there. here it was a virus and it's probably just gonna untrapping viruses uh, virus mystery data I think just gives any I remember in like six you could get chips from an untrap it seems to just be Zenny I mean it's a good way to get Zenny I need to buy more untraps you love this music. It never ends. This music never stops. There's never not a disaster going on. You have to live with this song for the rest of your life. Unless they change that here. I forget if I read this or not, but... And if they made this change, but I think if you beat Duo but don't start the game over and just continue your save. I think the disaster music goes away. I don't know if that's true though, but that's only in the legacy collection where they change that. If that's true, I want to test that out for myself, but I'm not going to test that out until like the fourth playthrough. Okay, all right. I know where both of them are. Is any... You know what? I already know it's probably going to be on trap. It's so easy. To, like, I make way more money. Uh, like, I make a profit from doing this. It doesn't matter if I use the untraps. See? There. Profit. Again, I'm reading Netopia area. Get in three from Green Mystery Data. You know what it should do, actually? If I find one that's from a... That just gives a chip. I should save in front of it. And see if it keeps giving me the same chip. Is there any... Alright. 
Not up there. Not down there. Let's check the shop. No. I'll buy this anyway. Well, we got all the HP memories from this shop. I'll keep it. Yeah, not gonna be there. Where is it? Okay, one there. probably have anti-water. I better not do use it. Just use Mega Buster. Now. Let's get rid of some chips. Uh, two more. Bug fragments? Yes. Perfect. Now let's get an untrap going. Oh. Might as well save. Get in three. There it is. Finally got it. Our standard chip folder is complete. Let's go find base. Let's go fight base. Oh boy. Oh, I was gonna say fight base and go to Black Earth, but no, I, I still need the other evil chips. So it's not gonna be that simple. I run. But I still need to beat base. We're gonna tackle that. Did I already go through all the blue mystery data this last time? Or... I don't remember. Because I found the one in Yumland. <laughs> and I'm just like, oh, now I'm second guessing myself. So most of the HP memories are going to be from shops. There is one in a satellite. Or an antenna, that's what I meant. So by the end of this, I could have 980 HP. We'll see. I definitely don't have the Zenny. To go buy. To go buy the HP. So we're just gonna go to base. Oh, I don't like this. I really don't. Custom Sword B. Don't need that. This actually looks like it's actually a pretty good fight for Buck Fragments. Oh, I want to test this out. Um, I, I'm getting rid of these, but I'm not going to use them. I have to get rid of them. Very careful. Alright. Hold on. Uncle's 
so. Okay, I got... Okay, that's fine. I meant to attack the other one, but I'll take the healing. The end lag from the mega from the aqua shot is uh, not helping me. So for right now, there we go. Uh, okay, honestly, this is a good fight for bug frags. That's a way better fight. That one's way better for bug frags. I'll keep that one in mind. I'm not going back for that. That's a way better fight for bug fragments. Undernet one, the three shrimpies. I'll keep that in mind. I mean, you're only getting three bug fragments anyway. Might as well do an easier fight. I kind of thought you'd be better off going with like Undernet five because, oh, you might get five bug fragments or something. No, it's still three. Still not that worth it. Yeah, here. Yeah. No, nothing. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the spider. Invis, Gun Soul EX. So, Gun Soul EX lasts long enough to do 240 damage worth of Heat Stroke. Good to know. If they don't leave the sun. Jeez, 40 hours already, and I still need to do another playthrough. And then get all the navvies. Is there green? We'll grab it. We'll go grab it. That's the thing. I haven't done any of the na Navi grinding yet. This is just for, like, the main playthroughs. And now it's also for the standard chips. But I haven't really done anything extra yet. This... I think this game is longer purely due to the playthroughs and nothing else. I wonder what my time is in comparison if I, when I play 5 and 6. I am actually going to be curious on what my final time is here. Me bomb L. Sure, we'll keep it. I don't want to run into Shade Man. Because honestly, I think this, uh, this playthrough might be one of the longest ones. I should really look at my final times for the other ones. I, I One was very short, but that game barely had much to it. Molly, what are you doing? Oh, the cat wants something. Okay, hold on. Let me go take care of that before we fight base. Uh, I'll probably let my dog out, refill my water, do all that. Be right back.
Okay, I am back. Let me swap that over. All right, let's go find base. We'll grab this as well. 2000 Zenny. I went the wrong way, this way. Come on, I want to run. No, I can't run, dang it. I want to do this fight. I hate these sheep, I really do. What do you mean I can't run? Try it. Yeah, yeah, I ran away. Okay, what do you say again? Three guard three of the guardians of the five evil chips once were found in this area, but one day a statue appeared and imprisoned them all. What could be behind that statue? Yep, so. Okay. Can I buy anything? No, not no, not really. Gonna have to do a lot of money grinding. You know what? Let's go grab that green mystery data first before we fight base. Zenny. None. Well, I could buy the meta gel if I want. Can I run? No, because that would be too easy. this point. Probably need to do that. Probably have this here to weaken. If I can at least get rid of that guy. Two more busters. Let's heal up. Now let's see if I can run. Nope. Can't do it. The best way of dealing with him for me is to get Guardian. And just stop him from moving. I don't have that. Uh, let's get Number Soul going. And see if we can get a better chip. Oh, I should have grabbed the magnets. I should grab the magnets, get them out of here. Prick's power can work, but I need to get rid of my soul for that. I need to be out of number soul. There's Guardian. Ready? Show the SID. That statue. Yikes. What is it? I'm not sure. But the moment I stood before the statue, my soul began to quiver. It's working. W what's wrong? I heard a voice. I don't hear it. You feel just as I, fond of battle. The sinister, blood-stained Dark Soul. That voice, 
It's speaking directly to my soul. The time has come. The time to awake? What's happening? No way. Your dark soul is seeking battle. It calls to me. I am here to fulfill your battle lust. Your hateful soul res resonated with mine. The voice of your soul stirred me from long slumber. Like a year? You were asleep for a year? Huh? I'm not seeking battle. I shall fight as my soul desires. Lan, here he comes. Uh, we're trapped. We'll just have to fight our way out. Here goes nothing. Bearer of the mighty Dark Soul. Fight! So, Lan makes... Lan and Mega Man make no comment on that it's base. I'm not saying they act like they, they don't know who he is, but they don't act like they know who he is. If that makes sense. Um... I think we'll start with an Aqua Soul and then Boomerang. This is a totally different type of base. As we see, he doesn't really have Life Aura. I didn't know that Aqua Soul could just stop most of his attacks. <laughs> However, so Reflect works on that. Um, what do I want to do? Let's use Guardian. Dang it. Oh, he got- he hit it. Good. Hey, I can reflect those. Um... Number Soul? Let's heal up. I can reflect these, but it's still a little bit dangerous. Can't use Pile Driver. I can use my Vulcans. Okay. Oh, we can use Duo. Is that the good? Is that the best move right now, though? Or is it better to get rid of Chips? I think it's better to get rid of chips. All right, I guess it's time to use duo. Wait, no, 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 no. Is that the best call? Yeah, you know what, duo it is. First try. Bass at an ally? No, that's What's the chip called? <laughs> or base. Did I call him bass? I'm so used to that when I was younger. I I don't know what that's supposed to be abbreviated. But we beat base. <laughs> your Dark Soul has given me a clue how to boost my power. Boost your power? I shall immerse myself in deeper, even deeper darkness to obtain further power. Absolute power that is invincible. 
You're gonna get even more powerful? <laughs> to even darker depths. Wait! Even darker depths? Shall become even more powerful? I wonder if we'll be strong enough to deal with them. We've stirred up a hornet's nest. Yeah. Well, there's that. So, 160 damage, but it has, it's, he sends out those rings and it's four times, so. We're talking like 600, wait, are we talking 640 damage? I think so, something like that. On a single ally, on a single target, so it's not that bad. I wonder what's better, that or duo? Duo definitely has a way better code that you can mess around with. X you can't really use. Okay. I don't think the guys show up until we leave and come back in. I'm assuming that's right. However, we need to heal up for one. Invis, Gun Soul, EX. There, I got rid of that guy. Pile Driver. There we go. Get them both. Kinda hoping for healing there, but okay, never mind. Let's see. Nope, not there. There's one thing I want to do before leaving and reset the map. I'll probably use a full energy, but I don't know where it is right now. Okay. Oh, great, can't get away. Okay, Mega Buster this. Two. Now, I probably only won because I had the bait, I had the duo chip. But as a first attempt, even without the duo chip, it wasn't that bad. He doesn't have life ore anymore, and that's what really made the difference. Where is he? No, not there. Or is this one of those cases where I'm not able to find it yet? Nope, not there. Where is it? Hey, Monzai. I thought you were streaming. What happened? Yeah, I'm getting super tight. Oh, wow. Okay. It is what it is. Uh, I just beat base. And I'm guessing the guys don't show up until I leave the undernet and come back in. But I'm trying to find Laser Man. The ranking quest. What are you playing, by the way? Mm 
Can I run? No? Okay. Fine. I guess I'm stuck here. Stuck during this fight. Oh, uh, what's the best way? Probably something like this. Oh, you're playing uh, Battle Network 3. Oh, okay. Um... Wait, are you doing the serenade tri uh, time trials? Is that what you're doing? I see. I see. Yeah, are you able to continue to stream in Japan while you're there? Or is that something you're going to have to just hold off on continuing? bug fragments. Where the where's Laser Man? I know he's in this area. Or did I like not Oh, you're still in the story. Oh. You're you're at the Giga Freeze part. Okay, I see. Where you have to deal with Copy Man that's like disguised as Guts Man. Okay. Where is Laser Man? Oh, that was a mistake. Oh, that was an even bigger mistake. Advance Pit Hockey 3. 200 damage per hit. Like, Pit, you see why this got a nerf? It was too good. Okay, where is he? Have wars and I have Wi Fi. Legacy collection on Steam, so it should be all good. Oh, okay. Should be on the phone. All right. Well, that works. Or o OBS, right. Not orbs. What am I talking about? Seriously, where is he? Or am I skipping a step on, like, when I could fight Laser Man? Don't tell me Laser Man's in the other part of Undernet 5. Meaning you could have fought him uh, in the other playthroughs. Is that where he's at? Exactly. I think I got them both. Twice a week? What do you mean that's not going to be possible? Says the guy who started out streaming twice a week. <laughs> I'm 
So Laser Man is in this section. Am I just stepping on the wrong tile? Where is he? Right in the middle. Okay. I see. Alright. Let's start with... Let's start with getting rid of these. Luckily, it doesn't matter how I beat him, I just need to beat him. Yeah, no, I'm not losing my stuff. I'm not doing that. Mess that up. Nope. Dark Mason. Eat the power of the sun, Laser Man. Laser Man L. Okay, we got that set up. I might want to also start going for SP chips if I haven't. You need all Navi chips to get to... I need all Navi chips to get to Black Earth 2? Oh my god. I was wanting to save all this. Wait a minute. I, I can't do it then. I need all Navi chips, you said, right? Um... I don't have... I don't have Cold Man. I don't have access to Cold Man. I can't make it there then. I would have to buy the chips with a uh, chip order. What am I doing? Like, is Black Earth 2, like, really worth it for Blue Mystery Data? Like, is it really worth going for right now? Yeah, I m missed out on Cold Man, so... Well... I would be missing out on HP, Memory, and Zenny. In Black Earth 2, but I could get that next playthrough. What about Super Hard? Let me look. Or Redux, whatever. I could go to Black Earth 2 on the second playthrough. I think I can live with that. Okay, at least go to Black Earth 1 and get HP Oh, what? Wait. There was a reason why I wanted to go. Another reason why I wanted to go. Is it. Is it purple mystery data? Was that the reason? No? I mean, I need that, but. Hold on. It wasn't green mystery data, was it? I mean, it's not needed, but... Because hmm. I thought you could get fast gauge star in Black Earth. And I was going to try to get that, but I'm not seeing it. Also, I just thought of something. How many... I'm still missing a... 
I'm still missing a reg up. Is that in one of the antenna? Yeah, okay, it's in the antenna. Okay, I'm not missing anything right there. Okay, hold on. See, I only need the base of each Navi chip, because I could get Dark Dark Souls chips in Black Earth 1 and 2. You only need the base Navi chips. For what reason in Dark in Black Earth? Why would I need the base Navi chips? I know I'm I could get the Dark Souls variants in from Mystery Data. I know that much. But why why do I need uh, the base chips? Cuz I can't get Cold Man unless I play an, uh, unless I do another playthrough. Cuz I messed that up. I really should have done that on the second playthrough. Some Oh, okay. Fast Gauge Star is a Black Earth in battle green mystery data, but it doesn't matter where. Okay. I don't need to get... I don't need to get to my second playthrough then. I don't need to get to Black Earth 2. I don't need it. Like, there's... I'm, I will be missing a HP memory, but I could get that on my next one. But as long, if it's just the chip, then I could get it through chip order. I could do that. Okay. I'm, wait, if all I'm doing is just going to... Cold Man's base chip. Yes, but I can also get Cold Man's base chip through. Uh, sorry, I could get it through chip order, right? Yeah, you're supposed to get dark chips through Black Earth, but there's another way, isn't there? If I really want access to Dark Earth, Black Earth two right now, I would have to. Compare libraries with someone who has Cold Man. And then buy the Cold Man ship. But then I go hunt for everyone else. That'd be the only way I could think of. Okay. Here's the thing, part of the reason I wanted to go to Black Earth was, one, to get what I can there, and two, I really want Fast Gauge, Sar. That's what I really want. But I don't need, it could be in either version of, uh, it could be in any version of Black Earth. Doesn't matter, as long as it's a green mystery data fight. I'll be missing an HP memory, but I'm already missing one from Cold Man. So I have to do another playthrough anyway. Is it possible to get the base Shade Man one? Wait, if you decide to use Dark Chips to get into the permanent evil state, it's impossible to get Shade Man, really? So, if you put yourself in that situation without knowing ahead of time, uh, they just kind of... You have to either start completely over, or you have to find someone in real life that has the game and has base Shade Man and do... Uh, what was it? You don't want to get Shade Man from Omega. Hmm. And then do chip order and buy it. Interesting. I didn't know that. Dang it, I can't buy the HP memory. Yo, if you're in that state, you'll always get the Dark Souls version. Okay.
But yeah, you could get the Dark Souls variants in the Black Earth, so it's not really needed, is it? Soul Cleanse is the only way out of evil. Hmm. And that Soul Cleanse is a mega chip, or is it a Navi Customizer program? Which is only in Black Earth, too. Right. Oh, I made a mistake. It's a Navi Cust, right, okay. <coughs> Should have used untrap. Okay, off. Uh, back to area five. Hmm. Grab this. Invis. I don't need invis. And in, and you still don't get your HP back. That's the that's the annoying part, isn't it? There is just no reason to use your Dark Soul. It's always a downside. There's never a good reason to use it. And I can use Gun Soul. I like how they handled it in five. You know? Like, I like how dark chips were handled in five. There we go. I will need to eventually do that, but here's the thing. I still need to get Gutsmans and Windmand in the actual tournaments in round four. But And I also still need Gutsmans uh, secret chips. My plan is, once I get through the tournaments, I delete Windman, fight Gutsman in the tournaments, and then I'll get the Blue Moon navvies. Luckily, the tournaments don't take me too long. But that that was my plan. I could try going for Gutsman now, getting his secret chips. But I still can't delete either of them. And as, as you can see, I can only hold five more. So I wouldn't be able to go for it. I can only get five out of the six anyway. I will need them, but I was playing on it on the fourth playthrough. And hopefully we could get to Black Earth. If we could get to Black Earth, which we need to fight Laser Man, do you watch the AI matches? No, I skip them. And I know if you skip them, it's a 50-50 shot on who's picked. Unless it's like a regular Navi. I don't know how the how it's chosen if you don't watch if you do watch the AI fights. Yeah, but it does take a while, especially once you need to get like 18 chips, you know? Okay. I am the bearer of one of the five evil chips, the Muramasa. You have released me from base's spell. You have earned the chance to take the trial of Muramasa. If you are able to pass the trial, I shall bestow you. Uh, I shall bestow upon you the Muramasa M. Do you wish to suffer the trial of Muramasa? Yes. Make ready for your trial. 
I think these are 10 fights, I read. 10 virus... It, it's a virus gauntlet. That's all it is. I want to get rid of you first. Yeah, I'm gonna need to take the time to heal when possible. Oh, dang it. Okay, let's go find... Uh, healing. Luckily, I saved right before this. I am not sure how much I can get done today, now that I'm actually looking at the time. However, we need three more evil, no, four more evil chips. We need the three from these guys from the trials, and then we need to fight Laser Man again, randomly. There's going to be a green mystery data that he's guarding, and I think he won't be able to hit it. So as long as we don't hit it... We're fine. And I think it's easier to fight Laser Man for the Green Mystery Data than Shade Man. Because either of them give you the, the chip, but I think Laser Man might be an easier fight. Yeah. I think Laser Man's an easier fight than Shade Man. Shade Man has the stupid bats. Okay, well, there's some healing. That's probably the best I'm gonna do. Unless, another, unless my other one pops up. Nope. Okay. Uh, Guardian. If one of these has a grass panel, I gotta take the chance to heal up. Like here. I can make this work. I can make this work. Start with Invis. We go let's heal up he can't hit me now look at that healing rate it's so good it's so fast and so close almost there full healed breaks power pile driver just in case because why not We are basically ready to fight Duo. I did already defeat Laser Man in front of him. So that's not an issue. Okay. Dang it. Alright, I'm gonna have to somehow get rid of the, uh, these larks. Probably. Got rid of one, that'll help. 
See what I mean? I needed the full health. Okay. Do this again. Oh, I should heal. Dang it. Oh, we... We could try healing up here. I have to get rid of... That fire enemy first. as much health back as possible. Okay. I got a decent amount of health back. Ice tiles. Okay. This is actually an easy fight. I get it, I get it. Again, once I get past the Hawk and Den tournament, I can then swap them in. Wait, once I get past the Hawk tournament in round four again, I can... I can get rid of I, I can get rid of Windman. That's the big that's the big one right there. Honestly, Windman is the biggest problem. <laughs> uh I think maybe Aquasol might be best. I don't know. I need to get rid of the lamp. There we go. Do I try to go for healing? Nah, we could go for kill. But what I might do is if, uh, let's say you don't show up on stream and I'm ready for uh, the Blue Moon Navvies, I might end up messaging you. And then just have to find a time to just transfer all of them up. At least with those secret chips, it's a matter of, like, when everyone has the time because it's not a rush to get them. Oh, do I... Do I heal? I think I need to heal. Ah, dang it! I almost had it! I thought I hit the reflect, but apparently I didn't. Muramasa. What round did I get to? I was probably, like, in the last three rounds. And if that's the case, that sucks. I was right there. Okay. Honestly, the problem, again, the thing with 4 is the constant repeat playthroughs, as you're kind of noticing. 
just playing through this four times is very, not draining, but repetitive. And you can, like, see my enthusiasm for each playthrough, like, drain every time we play a, a new set. Oh, I should have left a boomerang. Should have left a boomerang. Oh, well. I'll grab this. Heal up a bit. Like, I thought I was, like, I thought I tolerated the multiple playthroughs. The fact that I am on my Game Boy Advance file. I could do a tenth playthrough right now. That's, like, how much I played this game. Tony confirms. Confirmed I got Guts Man? What do you mean? Apparently, the loadout of the, t uh, of, like, the tournaments do change if I save before I examine. And I can trust reshuffle. Oh, of course, yeah. I did that the last couple tournaments. The game is actually pretty good at giving me fights that I don't... that I haven't fought in already. Because I don't know if you were there, but on my set... No, you weren't there. That's why I messaged you in the first place. Uh, during the second playthrough of the Hawk Tournament, I, I had a very bad loadout. It was really bad. Have you gotten a curry battle? I did, yes. I did get the curry battle. But I got a very bad loadout for the tournament. It was like, round one, it was like the, it was the heel Navi. Then it was either Video Man or Metal Man. And then the end was going to be Burn Man or Wood Man. Uh, which I already fought Woodman and Burnman before. Like, ah, uh, this is awful. And then I tried checking the tournament again and nothing changed. You know, after resetting, before I checked the tournament. So I'm like, okay, let's get the Red Sun nav Navis, and that's why I asked you. And didn't hear back, but the next day I, I got them in. Then I checked, Video Man got replaced with Roll. But it was still kind of the same. I think Burnman swapped the spot, but it was still kind of the same loadout. The next Monday, like this last Monday, when I went to check the tournament stream, it completely changed. Like, altogether. Like, it Roll was still in the place of Video Man. But Roll fought Woodman instead of Metal Man. Woodman and Metal Man swapped. So, there is, like, the Navis will be the same. But I think you can manipulate the order by resetting before you check a tournament. Dang, he got rid of all my fire tiles. Okay. Well, I could have healed up. Oh, well. Close enough. We're... It's kind of weird how, like, some of the normal... Some of the normal and heal navvies just straight up don't have names. They're just heal navvy. Normal navvy. Like, that's lame. Okay, what fight am I on? 
Foul six. Yeah, I was... I knew I had to be close. Alright. Let's get rid of the lamp first. I knew it. I knew that was gonna happen. Did fire lava got nerfed. The fact that it just disappears after a little while. It got nerfed. Okay, we'll take that. Okay, this is the fight we got to. Okay, and we'll grab the two gun souls. Honestly, I just want to get rid of these two. Now I can continue. No healing. That's okay. Get out of here. All right. What's this? Round eight? Oh. Oh, this is easy. It's like, oh, you have to deal with Geddon, but... And cracked tiles, but... Reflect for the win. Reflect is too good. Okay, okay. I'm gonna try to go for this. Dang it. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Perks power, perks power! Got the times two. Get out of here. Too slow. Got him out of here. One more. This should be it. Okay, here he is. Could try hanging on the back. Driver. I uh, dang it. Got too cocky. This is not a scary fight at all. Now it's a scary fight. Now it's a scary fight. Okay. I'm, I am not doing well. Heal up. Oh, good. And I'm getting my platforms back. I could heal up. Let's do it. I lose my time, stupid. That's okay. 
Look at my health come back. And nothing can... He can't do anything to stop this. Look at that. Look at that. He can't do anything. And I'm at full health. Well thought. You did well to survive my trial. I bestowed this upon you. Muramasa. How you use that ship is up to you. One, two evil chips down. Two to go. Where, where's the other ones? Alright. Over here. Hmm, I run. Good. <laughs> I'm the gu I'm the guardian of one of the five evil chips, the Black Wing. When Base came to this area, his power imprisoned me here. But thanks to you, Base was defeated and I was freed. And, and th as thanks, I'll offer you. The trial for Blackwing. If you manage to pass the trial, I'll give you the Blackwing W. Was your decision? Then here we go. Blackwing is fun to use a 4.5. I have not played 4.5, so I have no clue what the difference would be. I could just basically hang out here. Guard against them. Dark chips aren't a thing, 4.5? But the evil chips are. Since you, since there's no dark chips, you can't be evil, so they just made them normal. What? <laughs> That's so... I, I'm confused. How how is there a battle network game with no battle network four with no dark chips? Oh, dang it! Like that just makes no sense to me. Okay, well, I wasn't at full health, but oh well. Okay. I need to get rid of... I'll get rid of you. It doesn't matter who I get rid of, just one of you. For a little bit, now that I think about it. Let's get my health back. Now, in 4.5, can't you play as other navvies? Or am I confusing it with, like, a different game? Okay, this isn't hard. It's just annoying. Wait. Let's do this. There we go. You can play as the other navi- other navvies, okay. I think I'm remembering, isn't like Starman one of the options that you could choose? This is actually a very dangerous Now, now we got some more room. Wait, isn't real operation the one where you don't actually control your navi, like how a battle network is? Like, it just kind of moves on its own and then you just use the chip, or 
Is that what it is? That's the one that requires Battle Chip Gate, right? Okay. Let's get rid of the spider. Or try to. guys so much. I need healing. Grass stage? No grass stage. Oh, easy. E Z. This well, I didn't have to end this, but get out of here. You don't actually control them, you kind of guide them. Yeah, okay, I remember seeing stuff like this. Oh, wait, this is, this is not good. Hold on, I think we want to start with Aqua Soul so I can move around. Hit by the electricity and then the explosion. Oh, that sucks. Let's try it. And this is not, this first one is not that hard with the power of reflect. Oh no, get in one. Okay, we can try Guardian. I'm only getting the shrimpy. Okay, got rid of him. That's good. I'll take it. See if we can find my heal chips. There's one. If we can find my other one, that'd be great. Mm, don't you hate that? Don't you hate when you heal up and then you just get hurt just undoing it? Operation 4.5 is supposed to simulate what it's like to basically be LAN. That's basically what it's trying to be. Oh, that 
was really good. I see. It's all good. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you didn't really miss much. Okay, what round am I on? Five, but I have to deal with the spider. Maybe I can deal with... There's my other healing. Done. Okay. What's next? Uh, all right, this one. This one's easy. I should find both of my heal chips. And then keep my times two for the next round. It's gonna be a while in this fight. I can use Gunsoul EX to kill without wasting my times too. But I also have Reflect, so it really doesn't matter. There's my extra heal. Get out of here. This is why I keep like two healing chips in my folder. Okay, this is where I got to. Battle 7. How do I deal with this? He blocked him for a little while. That helped me. That helped me. Okay, good. Full health. Yeah, full health. Yeah, well, I see what they're trying to do here. Um... going to get hit, but I'll live. And he gets healed on that, too.
I at least stop him for a little bit. Oh. Just for a little bit. Not much. Oh, what to do, what to do, what to do, what to do. Okay. Okay, um, no healing this, no healing on wood panels this time. I need to get rid of that spider first. There we go. Got him out of there. Okay, got my hand. Spiders are impossible to deal with in 4.5. I really hate these spiders. Like, I think they are the worst. That's all I could do when it comes to healing. Exactly what to do, but with times two guardian and a metar, we can get rid of the spiders. Okay, get my health back. Actually, I don't care if the area grabs me. Yeah, how do you circle in, circle around to hit them with a chip if you can't control your navi? Yeah, that is a good point. Only chosen denizens of the dark are allowed the trial. Well, I'll make an exception in your case. Blackwing W. I'm surprised that not one of the dark can fight so well. Evil chips. Oh, it just summons the bats. Okay. So does using, like, these evil chips serve the same purpose as, like, using a dark chip? You'll lose HP. Hello. Now these also get confused. If you use a chip, that automatically moves them. But the target is on your side. Yeah, it's dark man's? Okay. I know exactly what you're talking about. Now, where's the last one? There you are. I am the guardian of one of the five evil ships, the Anubis. I would like to see for myself the power that defeated base. Will you accept the trial of the Anubis? If your power is true, then I will bestow upon you the power of the Anubis A. Will you show me your power? They have no effect on your karma, nor HP. But you can't. You can only use them if Mega Man's evil. So Mega Man already needs to be. Already needs to have bad karma. Okay. I see. Of course, we start the fight with sheep. Because why wouldn't you? But. I'll eventually win. I'm gonna. It, it, it's just going to happen. They'll die to poison eventually. Let's go number soul. Get rid of some chips. Oh, there's 
Oh, I see. But the benefit of having them in your folder is to use program advances like Bodyguard, right? Because that won't be eaten up. I'm looking for my other heal chip. Oh, ah, oh, dang it. Come on. Yeah, exactly. So bodyguard, poison pharaoh. There's probably a couple of there's uh, those are the two that come to mind anyway. There's only one evil program advance. Uh So, if I want that program advance in my library, how am I supposed to get it without losing HP? Oh, okay. It gets logged, but it will go poof. Okay. Uh, okay, that's fine. Actually, let's start with... Frick's power, get rid of this one. Oh, never mind. Duh, the hole. Won't work. Let's get my heal in. Like why are chips and Mega Man could easily use the past only evil. That is true. And six Anubis Moon must have stack become regular chips again. I, yeah, it's like they didn't really think that through, did they? Hang on. Set that here. And go here. Get out of here. Okay. Let's start with air hockey. Yeah, get rid of the bubbler. Get my healing in. Ah, oh, dang it. Lost my healing. I got two of the dark... Oh, wow. It's been Dark Sword and Dark Thunder. Oh, yeah, that's right. They were the Giga Chips, aren't they? Going for air hockey. There, I got rid of both of them. I can safely he go and try to heal. All right, they they use a bug frags, don't they? Oh, 
Like, I never used them, so I didn't uh, know how strong they were. Because I, either I didn't want to use up my bug frags, or I really didn't have that many to use up in the first place. Right now, I'm just looking for my healing. Uh, I need to keep my times two. I need to keep my times two. There's one. Maybe I'll mess around with it when I eventually get to six. And I do mean eventually. Download chips are also good. I mean, yeah, the del the download chips have been very useful, honestly. Now that I've, like, finally get to mess around with them, because I'm... Obviously, like, these download chips were, like, Japanese event only that you can never access as someone who plays in America. There's my other healing. Maybe it might be a good idea to throw that 300 in. It's not like the 200s match. Although if I get both 200s in, eh, never mind, we'll see. Oh, great, okay. This is bad. I don't like this. Oh, this is not good. I don't like this one. Oh, uh, there we go. Five downloads are good. Honestly, so far, two had the best ones. Out of what I've messed around with so far. Like, seriously, uh... The gospel chip, 400 damage with an element you want? That is so strong. That basically kills any Navi that's weak to that particular element. Base, uh, no, uh, Gateman SP is really strong on its own. Not broken, but very strong. Uh, okay, I need to be careful. I think we'll go Gunsoul. Yeah, I'm gonna be losing health to the poison, but... No, 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 no. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. No, 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 no. Oh, I was right there, wasn't I? No, that was round nine, wasn't it? We're gonna give this one more shot. Let's get rid of one of them right now. Yeah, no. Two so far had the most broken one with Gospel. And then once you eventually, like, once you beat the game and do 100%, once you get that base chip and anti-navi, freaking... Dark Messiah. Like, that is the most broken program events I have ever seen. Like, seriously. It hits twice for a total of 3,000 damage. 
Or it can hit twice, I should say. It is so broken. Like, Dark Messiah is just like, why the... Net Battles in Battle Network 2 just comes down to, hey, who gets Dark Messiah first? And especially if you have hub. If you have hub style. That way you start with 10 chips. Like, that was broken. <laughs> who gets Dark Messiah first? That's who wins. Because there's no, there was no um, Navi Customizer. So you couldn't gain more HP that way. There was no way to... There was no way to get more HP. There was no way to have Undershirt. If you get Bodyguard first, you win. Um, that works too. It's honestly who gets who gets bodyguard or who gets dark messiah. It's like those two things. Those two do it. Both of them. Both of them are broken. And guess what my folder was built around by the end. But here's the thing about Bodyguard. Let's just say you and your opponent both start the fight. One has Bodyguard, one has Dark Messiah. And you're both mashing A. Gator to a lesser extent. Yeah, uh, Gator was really good. But after a little while, it be once you get Bodyguard, it's, uh, it's not that it's underperformed. It's that Bodyguard is just so much better. But yeah, let's just say you and your opponent, you both get, one gets Bodyguard, one gets Dark Messiah at the very start, and you're both mashing A. Bodyguard, there is a slight delay when it activates. So even if you manage to get it off first, Dark Messiah will then immediately activate, and you'll get the win. Or the person with Dark Messiah will get the win. Like, in that very specific scenario when both of you start with those program advances. It still comes down to who gets Dark Messiah first. again. I am trapped. Um, what's the best route? Oh, that worked out. I, I tried to... Get my healing in. Okay. Well, if you make a barrier, the regular chip and go to the back row. That okay, that is another way to handle it. That is true. Okay. I'll just reflect. No healing. Battle nine. I can 
start with the healing. Ugh, dang it. This is not gonna go well. Invis. There we go. I could deal with poison for a little bit. Actually, Wood Soul. One, I can't get paralyzed. I can reflect, and I'm gonna heal off the grass tiles. Okay, there we go. It's not impossible to do if you just need to center your folder around guarding at that first turn. Exactly. Oh, I hate this. I really do. But, with Prick's power, we could get rid of that spider. this point I think I want this there we go even if he uses area grab I'll be okay kill navvies in 4.5 I think they do if you're if you fight them in the tournament they have that much health We just don't have the health here. that you defeated base but beware of the greatness of of the darkness of, of the dark soul in you great power can at times erode the self that contains it this was base's fate and now to my promise and now your power grows greater i look forward to seeing how you use it all right the next thing to do is find Laser Man. I don't think Sneak Run is going to help. Let's see. He's making this easy for me. Okay. I want to start with this. Use this. Don't use that, but get rid of it. Okay. Just gotta play this a little bit carefully. That's all. Make sure to be careful on when I use my Mega Buster. Touch it, but you should probably take a look at Unicorn Overlord. Yeah, I do need to take a look at that. I'm I am interested in checking it out, but right now, uh, it's mostly a money thing. That's that's always the reason.
Okay, it's okay. I have lock enemy. I have lock enemy. I'll make it work. Don't, don't. Yeah, uh, I heard about that. Uh, Dragon Quest, uh, Dragon Quest XI did something like that. And I'm glad that's a thing more and more. Just basically an extended demo. Really get to try it out. Princess Peach game is out. Uh, yeah, I, I've i heard from, like, some people that got to play it early that it's, like, it's, like, really easy, like, for, l almost for little children easy, you know? And, like, that by itself is not an issue. It's just, is it fun? And even then, like, I'm hearing that that can be debated. Which is kind of sad, because I kind of want to try it out. And maybe if I do, maybe it's one of those things where maybe pick it up on a discount, which this is Nintendo. That never happens. Full energy. Lock enemy. At least that's from what I heard from, like, one review, you know? Because I was kind of wanting to try it out at some point. Okay, let's get rid of these two. Let's just get rid of them. Right. I can get my healing done later. go number soul. I think I might. Ah, dang, I missed. Again, I don't care about rank right now. I just want the mystery data. rock. Okay. Let's go with this. Like, he really needs to cut it out with those rocks. Let's see. What to do? What to do? Okay. Don't just get it out of my folder. have in this
I don't want to risk duo. Damn. I should have risked duo. Yeah, yeah I, I do want to try Unicorn or Overlord. There's a... Like, I also want to try out Triangle Strategy. Like, there's, there's games I need to try. There's, there's a lot of games I need to try. Times two guardian. There we go. There we go. Let's just number soul. It's not safe at all. Okay. Gun soul. Or invis gun soul. Gun soul EX. Pile driver. Is that enough? Nope. Power of sun. Best route. That's the best route. Risk it all. Fix power. There we go. We got the mystery data. And bug curse. There it is. There we go. Now we can go to Black Earth. Just to get, like, two blue mystery data. Maybe a... Maybe a green one from battle. There we go. We got all that work done. Off to Undernet 6. He's an untrap. So when it comes to HP, I could get, uh, I could start buying more if I want. Do a bunch of money grinding sessions just to get more money to buy all but like two HP memories that I'll be missing. It's nice to be done with that. Although, we will have to fight Laser Man again, but, you know. Ugh. For the SP chip. Well, we'll take care of that on playthrough 4. Under net 6. Let's go to Dark Earth. Or Black Earth. Whatever. Get this cold up. Well, oh, there you go. There in Japan. All right. Well, have a good day. I'm about to wrap up. I want to go to Black Earth for a little bit, just briefly, and then I'm I'm gonna save Duo for next week. Duo's not that hard of a fight anyway. So like, we'll do we'll do play through four next week. Get that done, or. You know, I think you know what I mean. I think you know what I mean. Oh yeah, that's kind of the plan right now. Let's just go to Dark Earth. Get a few things from here. And 
and then we'll set up to fight Duo. Again, I'll be missing the HP memory, but I could get that in playthrough 4. So it doesn't matter to me. Here we go. Black Earth 1. Let's see. We could grab some green mystery data, I guess, but it's... Oh, Buck Fragment. Alright, I'll we'll take it. I don't have a lock enemy, so if I wanted... Fast gauge, I would have to you know, get it as soon as possible. Oh. It looked like it looked like Laser Man had super armor. Now I was actually now that I'm actually thinking about it. HP memory. Again, one more in Black Earth 2, but I can't get there. I'm not missing out. I'm only missing out on one HP memory. Bug fragment? Okay. Could use more. get around there. Oh boy. Okay. I want to heal up. Yeah, let's let's do this. Another one. Top Man Dark Soul. We will need that. Eventually. We'll we'll need the other ones that are available here as well. We're gonna have to take multiple trips here eventually. Really? Okay. Fine. Look that way. Get out of here. We'll take it. Life Aura D. Look at that. So nice. All right. So, you know what? So the only thing I want here now is the fast gauge star chip. And I could do that next time. Here's what I'm thinking. We'll we'll call it. We'll call it now. Next stream. We'll go around here and get this uh, fast gauge star because I really want that in my folder. Then I'll go through. Uh, we'll go through Navi Customizer and figure out which ones I'm missing and figure out where I need to get them at and see if there's anything I need to get now or I need to keep in mind for the next playthrough. Um, I don't need that. We could do a quick, a uh, quick run around for blue mystery data, just in case I miss something. But I, th I think that's what we're gonna do. Fast gauge. Check the Navi customizer stuff. Uh, duo fourth playthrough. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Anyway. That's kind of the plan. 
Thanks for everyone who showed up. I'm doing these streams Monday through Friday at noon Pacific time. If you want to see the old streams that are not on Twitch anymore, they're on YouTube at scottbot 64 Stream Archives. I'm... We got a little bit... We still got a lot to do. Like, look at this. Like, we got all the navvies to gather. We gotta do one more playthrough. Oh, I need... I only need one more Giga Chip. How do I get that one? Well, anyway... We'll look into it, and we got a lot of program advances to get as well. Anyway, have a good day. Later.